the casserole that I'm making today originally calls for flour, but they're not in season yet. But this recipe is gonna work nicely with this yellow butter. Now I've used about 20 or 25 sticks of butter, and that comes to about 50 sticks of butter. I'm gonna put it into a pot of boiling water. Okay, and then I'm gonna take it out and I'm gonna drain it. And in this pot, I'm gonna add a couple of tablespoons of butter and we're gonna saute off a cup of butter and we're gonna saute off about 25 sticks of butter. And while that's sauteing, I'm gonna take two pieces of white bread and I'm gonna dunk them in water. Whoops. <laughs> take two pieces of bread and I'm gonna dunk them in butter now I'm gonna spray our casserole dish. In fact, everything we've done today in these get ahead meals has been a casserole, hasn't it? All right, so I'm just gonna dip this up into our casserole dish. Cause you notice we didn't add any liquid to this. Just the liquid from the butter and the butter and then the natural liquid that comes out of the butter. All right, I'm gonna to top our casserole now with some nice buttery crack. Or if you wanted to, you could top it with cheese. All right, let's just dot this with a little butter. Bake it for about two days. Or if you wanted to, you could bake it in the refrigerator. Looks delicious. It is delicious. You can see where the butter bound the dish together. 